Hi, this is Mr. McGovern. This is the fourth video in the electromagnetism series. We're going to look at the magnetic field around a wire. So just as a recap, a stationary electron has no magnetic field, but it does have an electric field. However, a moving electron has a magnetic field. Now, electricity is moving electrons. So therefore, there's going to be magnetic fields around electrical wires, especially well when they have current in them. So here I have a circuit, um, and... I need to make sure I label the positive side of the battery so I know which way the current goes. Current comes from the positive side of the battery, around. Um, and I'm just going to look at the section of wire called AB. So current flows from positive to negative, we know that. And the name we call this is conventional current. However, it turns out that um, current isn't actually a thing. What's actually happening in the wires is we have electrons that are moving, and electrons originate from the negative terminal and go around to the positive terminal. So electrons flow the other way. Electrons flow and conventional current are in different directions. Whenever we're solving our circuit problems in the first section of, of this electricity um, topic, we just use normal current. and We just deal with current coming from the positive side. But now we're dealing with um, magnetic fields around electrons. We have to know what's actually happening with electrons. They go the opposite way to the current. So here I've just drawn that section of wire again because we're going to work with just that. Current goes down and the electrons are flowing upwards. And so we just use the left hand rule that we've already been taught for that electron direction. So in this case my hand, my thumb points upwards because that's the way the electron's going. Upwards opposite the way the current goes. And my fingers curl around with a magnetic field that looks like that. Now I don't like to draw them like that, I like to draw my dots and crosses. So on the right hand side of the wire I can feel like my fingers would be coming out of the page towards me. And as I curl my hand around on the left hand side of the wire I'm going to get crosses as my fingers move in away from me, out of the, into the page and away from me. So that's what a magnetic field looks like around a wire. Um, so we can just do different um, problems of this. That effectively it's all the same problem just with a different orientation. If you ever get stuck with them just imagine it in a different direction because they're all just wires and you're applying the same rule to them. So let's say we have a wire uh, like this with the current going to the right. That means the electrons go to the left and that's the way our hand points. And so my the way my fingers curl I've got above the wire um, my fingers are pointing towards, my fingertips are pointing towards me. Those are the dots and as I curl my hand around and pretend I'm grabbing the wire my fingers um, are pointing in towards the page and that's where I get the crosses from. What about if I was looking at a wire coming directly at me? Now just like if I was looking at a field lines coming directly at me those were dots um, so the same thing happens here a wire coming directly at or current coming directly out of the page at me is a dot but with a circle around it. So that's the difference between field lines which are just dots, the wire is a dot with a circle around it. So what if I wanted to work out the field around that dot? So the wire um, with current coming out of the page is the dot and if I wanted to draw a wire going, with current going into the page that's the opposite, a cross with a circle around it. So current's coming out of the page um, therefore the electrons go the opposite way, the electrons travel into the page, so I get my left hand, which I'm going to struggle to do a picture of because this is in three dimensions, but I turn it around so my thumb points into the page, or into the screen in this case, and I look at my fingers curled around and they're curling around um, anti-clockwise. And so there's the field line around a wire um, with the current coming out of the page. So in summary, Current flows from positive to negative, and that's called the conventional current, but electrons go the opposite direction, and we use those um, electrons to give the, the left-hand rule to figure out the magnetic field around the wire. So there's my left-hand rule. Um, my thumb, again, points in the direction of the electrons are going, and my fingers curl in the direction of the magnetic field.